It, it's it's different when you come out here and you put your uniform on for the first time and, and you're playing in front of your family and your friends and, and the band and, and cheerleaders and everybody are out here. And we had great support tonight. And, and we looked a little tight. We, we didn't really play loose. And, and it started at the beginning. Um, it had a lot of turnovers early and, and really couldn't get in a flow. That being said, Goshen came out and played extremely well. I mean, they shot the ball well. They handled the pressure very well and got off to a good start. Uh, you know, all that being said, I'm very proud of how, uh, of how hard we played. And, and we played a lot of people, as you, as you can tell by, you know, the minutes here. We played a lot of people, and we're going to play a lot of people. You know, a couple stats stick out to me. I mean, we had nine turnovers at halftime, and we talked about that was too many, and we only ended up with 15. So we did a better job of taking care of the basketball in the second half. You know, 17 assists is, is a great number for us. That means we're playing unselfish basketball. And we turned them over 28 times, so that's a great number for us as well. The big number here is our 80 field goal attempts, and we only made 33 of them. You know, we have to do a better job of, of focusing around the rim, you know, um, getting better looks. Sometimes we rush shots, and we need to shoot the ball a little bit better than that. But I give Goshen a lot of credit. They, you know, they came out here. It's a good basketball team. I mean, they won 18 games last year. They came in here 2-0, and and they gave us everything we wanted. And it was, a, it was a good first time out on the floor, especially with a young basketball group. This, this, was, a good, this was a good learning experience for us. Um, I thought overall we – did a pretty good job. We started off kind of slow, obviously, and um, first game of the year, we definitely have some things that we need to work on, but in the end, we got the win, and that's what really matters. Um, I thought we did pretty good overall. Like she said, we had a little jitters in the beginning, but I mean, it's normal for the first game, but I feel like coming out in the second half, we, we came out, we came out hard, ready to win. Well, I saw some good things from the defense, and I saw some bad things from the defense. The, the, the 28 turnovers is a lot, uh, obviously. If you turn a team over 28 times and we had 16 steals, that, that's a lot. But our backside, you know, we didn't sprint hard enough on the backside, so we gave up some uncontested layups on the backside. So we have to do a better job of, of, of talking and communicating of who has ball, who has backside. And then making sure we sprint back because sometimes what happens is when you press, if you don't, and they shoot, if we don't sprint back out of it, then they run in and get offensive rebounds. And we gave up too many offensive rebounds out of the press. Um, well, yeah, like Coach Paul said, um, this year we're really focusing on defense, and the guards are the start of that. So it's our job to really put pressure on the ball and pick them up full court. And I think by us putting pressure on the ball, it causes those turnovers. So that's our main focus is just picking them up full court and putting pressure on them for the whole 40 minutes. Um, yeah, I mean, I feel like especially in the second half, I mean, it was a, a clear shift in energy. And the way we picked it up in the second half showed like what we're really about defensively, um, pressuring the ball, jumping passing lanes, pressing hard. And we got a lot of steals and a lot of turnovers off of that. Well, I, I mean, basketball teams are going to be led by their upperclassmen, you, you know. And and Rachel came into the game, and the moment she came in the game, uh, came into the game, the game changed. You know, her aggression, offensively and defensively, that that is the Rachel Reinhardt that we know. And she was a handful tonight. I mean, she just played really, really well. Cam just puts pressure on everybody because she can get a shot off whenever she wants. So she does a great job of creating space and getting shots. I need to try to find a way to get her to the free throw line a little more, you know, because I feel like she attacks. We got to figure out why, um, you know, in the scrimmage that we had and then here why we can't get her more free throws. We got to get her to the free throw line a little bit more. But, but I expect a lot out of those two, and they did a great job tonight. Well, I mean, in the beginning, I was I heated up a little bit, so I was hitting a lot of shots in the beginning. Um, but that was because we were moving the ball, we were playing, we were playing up and down, getting fast breaks. The people were looking for me, we was all looking for each other, and I feel like that helped a lot in the beginning. Clearly, in the second half, I didn't hit that many shots, but we were playing as a team in the second half. It didn't really matter who was getting the shots. Where it was, we were getting layups off turnovers. We were running up and down the court. We was getting everybody open. Everybody had good looks tonight. So it, was, it I mean, it honestly was a team win. Well, a, a lot of that is what is what I talked about. Is when you've got five new players for the first time out on the floor, 
you know, it's going to be a work in progress. But we have a lot of talent. And I think anybody that was in the stands and watched the game knows that this group is just going to get better and better every time they're out on the floor. The, the team that you're watching now won't be the team you see on the November 13th, and it definitely won't be the team that you see in March because we'll keep getting better and better because, you know, we had a, a, a lot of returners who got very, you know, a lot of valuable experience last year, and then the five new ones can play. And, and they came in and showed that they deserve playing time as well. So I love looking down here and seeing – one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ten players in double figures in minutes. You know, ten players in double figures in minutes. I mean, that's, that's, that will bode well for us as we play a 29-game season.